What's up guys, welcome back. We'll have a look at Love, which is by Keisha Cole. And uh, just thought of like showing you how to play this song nicely. Let's get started. No capo, this song is in the standard tuning. It's basically this sort of like sliding riff or sliding chords which we have in the song. So there you have it. What we have is, <clears throat> I'm sorry. We got D string second fret. Then our pinky should be playing the fourth frets of the bottom three strings if you can you can use these three fingers if you feel like but i'm not personally a huge fan of that way so i'll just go like this on the right hand my thumb index middle ring will be nicely hooked up uh, playing the dgb and the high e string respectively so what i'll do is i'll plug the shape and take it one fret up and this is the original shape f major seven so we got after doing that, we'll play the third fret on the D string once and then repeat that four times in total, which means one, two, three, four. This is how you play the chord, right? So we got one, two, three, four. And now it goes to more of like this, a bit of critical shape, which I, can't, I think like this. So what I'll do is now instead of ha having second fret on D, we'll have third fret on D. And this, the pinky will be still in the same position. I'll bring it one fret up, so it will be now from three to four on the D string. So we got. So it's only this one note, which was from here to now here. So we got. When I come to a G minor seven, I have my index finger barring the. Uh, 9th fret, we got B string 10th fret, ring finger on D string 11th fret. I'll pluck the middle 4 strings this time, so A, D, G, B. Uh, same thing, slide it up 1 fret, and then hit the A string. 1, 2, 3, 4, and then we have this shape. This is a E diminished 7, might be familiar with it. We got A string 6th fret, ring finger on D7, pinky finger on B7, index on G5. Right, so again, this will be one fret up, slide it up, then hit the E string. Right, so we got F major 7, F minor 7, flat 5, G minor 7, and E diminished. So after that you can, <clears throat> I don't know why I just keep getting a sore throat. Anyway, after this you can simply just like strum the chord once. I wish that I can Next chord. And that's how you can play the full song. These are the same chord shapes, the first two. We just change the position. From this position, we come to this position. That's it. Guys, there you have it. That's how you exactly play the song. I hope the video helped you out. Uh, let me know what other song you want to learn. Thanks for subscribing, guys. We are very close to 25K. Uh, so keep subscribing. And um, I'll see you guys back in the next video. Until then, bye.